Hey everyone, how's it going? This is Kill Ten Rats. Welcome back to Sorcerer King, the oblivious playthrough. <laughs> I'd rather not even call it blind. I just call it like I I don't know what the hell is going on. No, it's it's actually coming along quite nicely compared to my overall experience with this sort of thing. So I can't really complain at all. We just lost a fair amount of our troops, which is a little bit um, annoying, I guess. And we've got another one of these cavalry doom stacks running around here, which is kind of unfortunate. We will have to found another city. And I want my army to go to the inn as well. Let me just quickly check who is damaged. Okay, these guys would probably benefit from a major healing potion. Uh, okay, who else do we have that's suffering? Okay, he's not doing so well, neither are they. You guys are probably fine with a minor potion. Token of the wolf. Summons a wolf. Does it summon him just for one uh... is this permanent or is this um... just for one battle let me just use that and see what happened just now hey yes that seems to be permanent uh, so defense for you I guess Okay, that's not bad. Spell resist, defense, spell damage. Spell damage, okay, that settles it then. Um, you get that. Uh, no shield for you, I think you have a helmet, yes indeed. Chain shirt for you then. We have gloves on you, that's fine. The bar's actually pretty strong. So I guess gonna equip them a little. Mm, yeah, sure. Uh, kind of want to heal the little doggy here, <laughs> whatever it is. A darkling, stronger than a normal one, but that's not saying much. Yeah, he's actually the darkling is actually quite um, quite useful in in some ways. Uh, because of this position swapping that he can initiate. But that's about it. Okay, we can make a studded leather helm. We can make more rings. No, we can make a chain shirt as well. Let's make a chain shirt. Uh, let's make a chain shirt for you guys. Uh, we can make another one. Okay, let's get our armies a little bit upgraded. Maybe it'll help. Okay, did we just... Did this work? It did. Okay. Okay. That wasn't so bad. Right, so we have our troops here and I guess I want them to go to the inn okay they can't move anymore this turn we are sort of anticipating an attack by a looter's army so let's see how that goes who's our idle units okay he's idle that's fine and our exploratory Magellan expedition here is doing its thing Okay, is there a way around here? I think there is. Sweet. And this is sealed off, I guess? From the Midnight Stone. Fearful fog. A fog with enough putting smell. So I don't think we can pass here. Can we? Rather not risk it. I'm gonna go here instead. Just do a bit more looting. Oh wow, so much nice stuff. 
Oh, he's doing his market maker event yet again. Um, yeah, I guess we'll trade some rubies for severwood oil. To use with the Forge of the Overlord. Yes, I understand. Use these ingredients prudently, friend. My patience is not infinite, and I will not look kindly on those who use my own gifts against me. Well, that's unfortunate then, because that's exactly what I'm going to do. <laughs> uh, right. Spider place is still scary. Oh, what's this? Swamp stronghold? Ah. This this camera jockeying around is sort of off-putting. Okay, we should probably found it here. Because that had access to the forest. And uh, has some production as well. Okay, Sovereign leveled up. Can you stop with the destroy messages already? Leadership, maximum army size plus four, indoctrinate, gain plus one favor from all minor races. Okay, that's probably not what I want right now. Army size, on the other hand, seems useful. How are these guys doing? Oh, 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 oh. Okay. <laughs> Hmm. Hmm. Strength 8. So last time our cities got attacked, there were two archer troops in there who... Um... Oh god, we can't summon them. Okay, we might actually have to do something about these guys. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, Tandis. And. There's only going to get Tandis alone. Hmm. Or does it get his entire stack? We'll see. Oh, it brought the pikemen along. Good. Good, good, good. Can always make this friendly territory and then beam him back. But I don't really want to take any chances with that against that army. I think it might be fine with the escaped experiment there, just because it's... um, Like, if there is really two archer units in there that just spawn uh, to defend the city, then we should probably okay. Okay, well, if we get an archer, we should have some nice stuff for them. We can also craft these things. So let's do that, I guess. Anyone here who still needs them? Uh, you have leather helmets, so I guess we can replace that. And sort of do a hand-me-down. Mm, okay. Yeah, that works. Um... Let's see, do I want to... Idle cities, okay. Anything here that will improve production? Actually, Onyx Throne provides one skill plus one for every shard connected to the city. Interesting. Unlocks crafting recipes, unlocks the enchanter, a magical unit that requires crystal. Unlocks rider units. Increases food per city level. Provides plus two production per city level. It leads to watchtower. Workshop. Let's build a work camp. Seems good. Do need some more pioneers as well. Uh, okay, ship is coming along. So far we haven't run out of places to go yet, so I'm going to explore some more. And let's see what's going on here. Anyone attacking us? The city of Attica is under attack. Okay, 
pikeman archer archer and tendis yep that was exactly what i was thinking would happen so those two archers definitely are tied to the city oh god these guys <laughs> it's like oh god you poor poor fellows ah I guess we're done here. Why now? <laughs> oh, okay, they brought some archers. Okay, well, that's fine. Why don't our archers act? Uh, please uh, enlighten me why our archers aren't doing anything. Okay, there we go. Die, 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 die. And victory. Okay. Oh, and the other city didn't get attacked. That's also nice. These guys are about to enter the tavern. Yeah, let's do that. Wait. Oh, God. That's the one that's tied to the unearthed dungeon. Ah. Um, do I want to teleport these guys anywhere? Do I want to teleport these guys anywhere? Okay, this guy is just loitering around here, that's fine. Um, I don't really want to teleport them yet. I'll just have them move around here a little. Because I kind of want to see where that um, where that army went, that uh, barbarian hero army, and it looks like we found another civilization, swamp giants. First contact. These swamps are ours. You can't make us leave. Who are you, my massive and soggy friend? I won't ask you to do anything except for fight the sorcerer king. I kind of do need help with that. I don't want you to leave the swamps. Please take the swamps. Watch how much I don't care. <laughs> uh, okay, so we found Shrek. Um, who are you, my massive and soggy friend? We are the Swamp Giants. Well, the name fits. We were not always Swamp Giants. Used to have kingdom long ago. Then evil queen forced us from our land. That does sound like an evil queen. Which one was it again? Prosipini, Paridan Queen, she know like giants, says we are fallen, but we are not fallen. Prosipini is long gone, my damn friend. I'm sure there's some way we can get your lands back. We can get lands back by ourselves, dry one, by making axes and swinging those axes ahead. But if you dry ones wish to help, I not stop you. Yes, I will send word to other swamp giants. You help them, they help you. You help them, his whole big process. Sounds like what we call a friendship. We'll see you later. You take your leave of the soggy creatures, plus one swamp giant's favor. And we immediately proceed to nick their stuff. Um, you guys are pretty strong. You guys have shards. And you have it built on, uh, on your shards, I guess. Did you uh, take that from my personal playbook? Okay, Tandis was um, leveled up. Immune to counter. Enemy units kind of counter attack. I like it. I really just want to go for the maul ability, so I don't really care what's uh, what's in the way there. Uh, okay, I don't think we actually need him to um, teleport anywhere because of the roads here. That should be sufficient to get him back to the action pretty quickly. I think it only takes like a turn to get this far. Why aren't it showing me? Uh, why aren't it showing me the pathfinding here? Come on, show me the pathfinding. Thank you. Okay, yeah, we go this far. Try to reunite with the other army, and it seems we have found a way to swing around here. So I guess I can use my scout to um, discover the other civilizations and uh, sort of form friendships already before we break out of um, of our confinement. So that's pretty neat. 
Right, for some reason this disappeared again. The resources uh, are no longer visible. No idea what triggers that actually. It's a bit annoying though. Hmm. Was it this square? Okay, what's this? World report, blah blah blah, yeah, okay. Diplomacy, swamp giants. Oh, we can speak to them this way. And favor, complete quests for a faction to increase favor. Once they are fully allied, you'll gain their assistance. Okay, that's how that works. Cool. We have the dungeon of intrigue. We have the someone else's problem. Travel to this town and clear it of the... Where was that again? Oh, that was here, wasn't it? Yeah, I guess if we sort of assemble our our armies here, it'll it'll get us doing that, maybe. Right, this is a little irritating. I want to found the city on the right square, but now I'm not seeing the um, fertile land uh, details again. I don't know why that is. I really don't know why that is. Hmm, okay, yeah, that's fine. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna save it and reload it just uh, so we can actually have um, maybe a view of the tiles that are um, to be built on because uh, I don't trust myself to build it on the square that I want to build it on without checking. I, there was a tile that had production as well as food and that's the one I want. Okay, it seems to have been... Yep, it seems to have loaded back in and this is the correct tile. Okay, fine. Uh, this, this has to be some sort of bug, doesn't it? Okay, settle. We will settle here. Let's just quickly check again. Yeah, we have the forest access there for some resources. Yep. And we will call it Naf Nafas. Uh, maybe Care Nafas. So it's the city named after our great warlord. Now, of course, he will get ideas above his station and uh, do horrible things. We'll move the administrator into the city. And Tandis can meet up. Where did the barbarian hordes go, though? Hmm. Let's have Tandis wait here. Let's have them reunite. Okay. Actually, let's have Tandis go here. And are we the right? Yes, okay. Cast. That should have worked. Hmm. Interesting stuff. Ring of Mastery, Wolf Cloak. Neat. We are making a nice bit of um, profit from all these chests that we can open here. But I think we should be focusing on uh, setting across here as well again, and then uh, just going try to find another civilization. There's actually a settlement that we can... Oh, it's actually weak. Okay. I wonder if if we can take an army and bring it over there and just settle. But on the other hand, it sort of makes us all over the place. I, I kind of want to fortify this so we have our own uh, safe zone here that we can't, uh, that, uh, that's, that's, you know, that won't be reached that easily or breached that easily. Okay, so that's a pretty nice start. What can we build? Can we build, start with a garden? 
start with a garden. Okay. There can be no more expansion. What do you think you're doing, you imbecile? Athica expands again. Do you plan to start another war with the other remnants? Or have you something even more foolish in mind? The other remnants are expanding, I need to crush them. I tire of being a creature. Murdoth, Athica will answer you to you no longer. Apologies, my lord. Can I make it up to you? Persuasive choice. Make it up to me? Yes, perhaps. Provide a portion of your life force to me to fuel my ritual. Only that will save you now. Okay, five doomsday counter. And he's doing market maker again. Let's get some more cedarwood oil. And dodge the bullet there, I feel. <laughs> okay, what's that about? I think if we go and claim that other shard, we're probably boned. Like if we go and claim that one, he might just completely flip his uh excrement to put it gently a deadly enemy uh. I do have a nice bit of mana though who do we have with us we have both our heroes I don't really know what to make of deadly. Like what what how does that scale relative to uh to everything else, I wonder. Right, I think I want to have uh work camp here maybe, garden, command post. We don't have a garden here and that's a bit of a joke, so I guess we need the garden for sure. I also need some pioneers again. Okay. Uh, I just want to scout this out. I'm, I, in this particular instance, I'm not above um, reloading just because it's such a kick in the uh, progress if we completely wipe someone else's problem from outside the village. You can see it. A Abandoned, but for a pair of foul warks and their foul riders roaming the streets. Ooh. From the edge of town, some of the villagers look at you hopefully, clearly expecting you to leap bravely into action, even though you haven't stretched your brave leaping muscles yet. Warks and riders. If it's one or if it's two units or something, if it's a pair, then we could be making it. You charge into town screaming something which hopefully sounds really intimidating. Okay, let's see. Hmm, it's two of them. We do have the counters. Let's give it a shot. What else can we do? Smite. Nice bit of damage. Oh god. Yeah, well, that was uh, the unit I was most prepared to lose. Don't you dare. Okay, that's fine. Um, you are in a weird spot there though, so if I could just get you to come here. Thanks. And then maybe... Pass. Who am I? Quick. Okay. Uh, dark spread. Nightmare. Give me some healing. Sweet. Okay, I kind of want to get these guys out of the way, but, um, eh. okay, nice, so, slay mounted, <laughs> and, uh, slay mounted, bye now. <laughs> The villagers who accompanied you are astounded at your victory and offer to accompany you on your journey. You stroke your chin, assessing their use. They're good at being villagers, obviously, but with some swords they could probably damage others more than themselves. No, 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 no. Pioneers, pioneers, pioneers. Plus one fame, plus one courage, ex-villagers, round shield, platinum chain, hunter's short sword. 
Nice, 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 nice. Okay. Right, let's check out the dungeon as well then. Join the Guild of Dungeoneering here. Okay, we don't probably want to end up on that tile, so we're gonna go here instead. Oh, there you are. Hmm. Last time you really kicked my ass, and uh, an ass kicking is not needed at the moment. Hmm. Oh no, I've got the pioneers on the battlefield. How about now? Uncertain results, yeah, I know. That's a little too much cavalry there. Whew. Uh, okay. Yeah, that could work. Run up and blinding strike them. Okay. And... I guess we can... Um, hmm. Doesn't make much sense, does it? Okay, I'm gonna... Run away there. And just pass. Do I want to dark spread? I'm gonna try Nightmare. That never really does seem to do anything. Hmm. Even though he was afraid, even though he was debuffed, he almost killed him. Okay then, if you say so. Mm-hmm. Good. Slay mounted. Might even go for impale, but I think that doesn't do as much as slay mounted will to these guys. Let's go up there. See if we can take one of them down. Mm. Hmm. Smite. It's probably our best option here. Okay. Now, little fella, I need you to get me a heal on this gentleman here and I guess we're going for the mega doom cast Oof. Jesus Christ <sighs> those one shot abilities man Do I really want to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with these guys? Yeah, was, what else can I do? Not doing a hell of a lot of damage there, my friend. Oh, God. Okay. Stunned. Slay mounted again. That should take you down. Okay. Um... um, 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 um. Right, let's try a little bit of positioning shenanigans. Get over here. And then we'll scurry. And that doesn't really help because we can only move one tile. That's annoying. Okay, well. You're dead then, I guess. I uh, can't stun them. Mm. All right, it's eight, it's 
29. Overwhelming fear. Train life. Come on. Hmm. Not as much as I hoped, but it'll... It's something. Maybe I can save the little dude after all. Go away. Nope, can't. He's dead. Oh, cool. Yeah, that's that's okay. Uh, I'll go here. And kick in that sleigh mounted again. Right. Let's do that again. Hopefully take them out. Almost. And now you please die. How much damage does this do? Hmm, he's got five health left. I have to hope that he will do five damage. Yep, okay, cool. Nice, sweet. No taking chances here. Bye bye. Okay, okay, we lost one soldier. That's acceptable. What do I do with you? Do I claim the shard? Or do I claim... Or do I build another tower or upgrade the tower up here? I'm a bit worried that if I claim the shard, we'll get into trouble with the Sorcerer King. Um, I don't know where the threshold is there. That's... That's the main issue. I mean, it's tempting to claim that one. And it's probably the best move to claim that one. But it's also pretty much the ultimate throwdown. Uh, I'll think about it. I guess we'll see next time uh, whether we want to play it safe or play it a little more risky. And... At least we found at the city. We have fought some battles and won some victories. We've potentially made an ally. So all in all, that was a pretty productive episode. I thank you very much for watching. I'll catch you next time and bye for now.